guys. I thought I would do you, you, me showing you how I do my makeup and stuff. I've done this once before, my everyday makeup routine, but this one's just going to be like a chilled out one. I am going to edit it because I think it's going to be like 30 minutes long and yeah, so I'm going edit, to edit it. But it's just going to be like a chilled out sort of video. I have got a top on, if it like don't look like I've got one, I have got one. Um, it's just like a black vest top. Um, and I am, my skin's not that bad but it is quite bad. I have got a few spots here, here, like around my eyebrows. That's where I mo get the most spots. So like on my chin, on my nose, and then here and here on my forehead. That's where I mostly get my spots, and it must be really oily there. I'm not gonna do like any moisturizers because I've already done that. Um, I done that like two hours ago, <laughs> so I'm not gonna do it again. But yeah, it's just gonna be a chilled out video. So I'm just gonna get a baby wipe and just. Do that. I normally use the micellar water to do this, but I don't have, I don't have um, cotton wool pads at the moment, which I need to get. So, and if you guys are off school, then tell me in the comments. I broke up yesterday on the Friday. So yeah. Um, I'm gonna be. I'm not gonna use a prank actually, shall I? I'll just use it. This is not going to be a going out look, it's going to be like um, like a normal, everyday look. And give it a thumbs up if you do like these videos, because I'll do more like chatty videos. Chatty looks. And if you want like makeup. Oh, when I get to 100 subscribers, I am doing a room tour. So if you want a room tour, then just get me to 100 subscribers and I'll do one. Because I changed my room about. <laughs> It didn't look like it that there, but I actually have, because I have, um, oh my god, I've got some on my lip. Uh, I have, forget that piece, I have got a dressing table now, so that would be good. I'm using it right now. And if I look over there, I've got a mirror there, and if I look down here, I've got a mirror down here, so I'm just going to be using both of them, but yeah, probably this one more. For my face makeup, use this one. For my eye makeup, use that one. And yeah, I'm so excited because I got two weeks off. <laughs> I'm gonna try and post a lot in the two weeks off, but if I don't, then sorry. <laughs> I wanted to keep talking because I want it to be chatty, but I don't want it to be like too chatty because I need to edit some out. <sighs> it's already been three minutes, so I've only gone and done my primer. That's good, isn't it? I think my primer's done now. Gonna go on to foundation. I'm using the Rimmel Max Perfection and my primer was the Lumi Magic one. Which I've got a love and hate relationship with. Right, that will just have to do. So I normally put two pumps, but it didn't come out, so I had to use loads. Why is it come out? I just have to take the top off because it's not come out, literally not. There's actually loads in there, so I don't know why it's not coming out. Basically, I do it with this brush first, and then I go in with a beauty blender. And I blend it down my neck because I don't want any harsh lines. I'm sorry that you can't see me, I keep going back like that. And I did put my coat there so you couldn't see the light, because it don't really look nice with the light. As I know, all of you wanted one because it's mostly cre most requested video, so that's why I'm asking. 100. <laughs> I'm not asking, but like I'm just saying, if you do want a room tour, get me to 100. Um, so yeah, that's my foundation done. I'm just gonna go into a little bit more because it needs there needs to be more on my forehead. Yeah, I'm using it like this because I haven't got well, I've got loads left, but it's just not coming out in the pump. So, yeah. That's all my foundation done. Oh, I'm gonna go into um, wet my blue beauty blender and then I'll be back. Right, I've wetted my beauty blenders, wetted all of them because I use three beauty blenders. Um, so I use this one to just make sure my foundation is blended. As you don't want them streaking lines. Like 
I'm much more sure about my bedroom now than what it was before. But I still think that I would like my bedroom a little bit more different and would like new furniture and stuff because this furniture came with the house and it's not my own furniture. My own bed is, but none of the other furniture is. So all the furniture came with the house. Not all of it, like everything in my house, but like all my furniture in my bedroom came with the house. So yeah, I'm not sure what I want my bedroom to be like when it's done. I think I'm getting it done next January or even before that. But I'm getting extension Monday. Yeah, starting extension Monday, so we should have it soon. Um, extension soon, and then after that, it's my brother's and my my bedroom to be done. So yeah, that's what's happening. And we're getting a new kitchen as well, so that should be good. If I don't upload videos, that's why probably. So, because there will be a lot of building work done, be being done. So, like on the weekends and stuff. So, I'll probably have to do some videos on the two weeks off. So, so you know, it'll be the two weeks off. So, yeah, I will be able to do it. Well, I will try to do it. <laughs> So I just put it on all my spots and all the highlight points where I want to highlight and my under eyes. Put a lot of this on because I think I just look more nicer with it. I used a Wake Me Up concealer which is really good. And I use this beauty blender so I'm going to put some stay matte powder on me which is the best powder ever and i'm probably not going to go to another powder now. and i'm using the real techniques powder brush which i love and one reason why i'm doing my room tour so um when i get to 100 is because i still need to put stuff in my room that i want so like i got the acrylic um tub for my makeup but I want like the acrylic drawers for my makeup to go underneath it so it's nice and tidy because I have this massive Suella awesome draw sim set which I do put some of my makeup in and it is good but it's too big so that's why I want some like little acrylic drawers underneath my acrylic tainer thing so yeah that's why so that's why I want to get one of them but I haven't saw one yet well I have saw one but I'm just waiting until we get 100 so i can just put it in but yeah that's why that's one reason why i haven't done it and why i haven't done a makeup collection video so yeah and i got loads of, i got rid of loads of my makeup um yeah when i was doing my room so yeah the makeup that i don't use anymore and it's probably going to go to like car boot sales and stuff like that I am chucking some of it away because some of it's really old, like two years old, and I don't even use it because it's so old. So, and you're not like meant to use makeup when it's like out of date because there's um like um a container thing at the back saying how how long you can have it for. So, well, how long you can use it for? Yeah, that's why. So powder done. Now we're going to go on to um, just a little bit of bronzer. Don't really want anything too dramatic. So I'm just using the Kate Moss Sculpting Palette in the colour Coral Glow. Colour Glow. And I just use the contour shade because I don't have a bronzer. Yeah, Yeah, so that's that job. Now we're going to want to blush. When I put blush on, I think that I'm ready. But when I don't put blush on, I'm like, I'm not. I don't feel good. That's what I feel like. Um, I just use the same brush. It's the B powder brush, which is meant to be for powder, but I use it for blush and con um bronzer. See, it's just so nice. I 
and it's not on it's not in the stores anymore which is really sad because i think i've had this for like two years and it only lasts for how long did it last for 36 months so it lasts for three years so but the color is like off so i think it's but it's fine when i start getting spots there that's when i will stop using it because i will know it's this so that's just so nice it just gives you like a little like ah, which i do like blend in because it's quite powerful but i just love that blush it's the max factor blush in chestnut so good <laughs> right and then i just because it's quite strong and it does have a little bit of glitter in it so it can act as a highlight as well um but i am going to do highlight as well this i put it in my favorites liked it last month don't really like it this month i just don't think my skin suits gold highlight and pink not really either so i'm just gonna use the highlight in this one because why not <laughs> I am going to put some of the pink highlight, but I don't really like the gold one. And this is just a white highlight. Oh, it looks like white. If it's gold, then mm, I hate gold. Yeah, it is a white, silvery highlight. But it just don't last all day, like it comes off in the day. So yeah, and I just feel so much better when I get my eyebrows done. Got them done like two or three days ago, which was really nice. Um, I'm just gonna put some of the pink highlight on because it is, it's all right. It's not amazing, but it's all right. But I just put the tiniest little bit on. So at the end of the day, I still have some highlight because this does stay all day which is good um so that's the highlight mm. Mm. yeah um i'm gonna go on to mascara i don't have eyeshadow on every single day but i'm gonna put some on use my naked palette but i'm just gonna put buck in the crease because that's what i normally do i'm just put buck in the crease buck 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 so it's just this one here. It's like a like matte chocolate brown. That's the one way I could describe it. So I put it in the crease with just this brush that you get with it. Which is actually really good and you get it with palette. So basically if you buy the palette you get a brush. I actually really like the Ica palette. I'm not gonna say because it's really expensive or anything, but I actually do really love it. And I would recommend the naked one than all the other nakeds because the other nakeds are like okay but i'm where i reckon where i reckon i recommend that one <laughs> um so i'm gonna go into this brush which is a revolution blending brush and just blend it out because you don't want it too overpowering you know so i'm just gonna curl my lashes so i'm gonna use the lash sensational this is it. And I just take off the access mascara because you don't want too much mascara on there. And I just use this mirror down here. So I'm just going to... Yeah, I'm actually feeling my makeup today. Like, don't normally do this, so... So I'm just gonna use some lip balm from Baby Lips. Yes, yeah, so this is just the Melomania one, which I love. My routine as well, yeah. But that's it. This is nothing finished makeup look. Which is like really like natural and like every day. Still I got my vlog to go up because I didn't put it up last week because I was really busy um but yeah i will put that up soon hope you enjoyed this video give it a like subscribe and comment down below what you want me to do next and i will see you in my next video bye